Hi, Aries. Happy birthday, guys. Welcome to your extended love reading for April. Um, I'm going to leave the link below. I did an end of the month, March, end of the month singles reading and love reading. So you can click on those links. I also did a reading for the next three months. Three, six, um, I'm sorry, April, May, and June for career, love, and finance. So you might want to check that out. Add clarity for love messages to this reading. I did just open up my Etsy shop. It's Lotus444. I am beginning to add reading slowly to it. Um, you know, between my 12-hour shifts at the hospital and doing the readings on here, which I love to do, I'm trying to get that up and running. So, you know, head over to there. If you've asked me for a reading, now you can um, check it out over there, okay? And this is going to be a reading for you and your person, but then it's also going to be from zero to four months, how it's going to, you know, proceed, four to eight, and then eight to 12. So it's going to be extended for all of my Aries. My dad is an Aries, April 3rd. And I love my dad. He is the, probably the most amazing man I've ever met in my entire life. I was always a daddy's girl. So I'm very, I have my heart definitely pours out for Aries. Masculine and feminine. I just always see the good in the Aries because of my dad. All right. Love messages, spirit for Aries. Sun, moon, rising, and Venus. Oh boy. Healing family issues. Your love life benefits as you forgive your parents. And then, hold on. Actually, two just flipped over, so I'm going to take them. You deserve love, which of course you do. And heart-to-heart -heart conversation. Honestly discuss your feelings with one another, okay? And then I'm going to pull the Lover's Oracle card. Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Thank you, Spirit. Oh, wow, these are very similar, the white wings. You may not always understand why certain things happen. However, there is always a higher purpose to the events in your life. Through turmoil, a blessing will soon be revealed. And let's see what this one is. The past is now behind you. Release it and embrace new possibilities. A new path is now available to you. Follow it with faith. Pay attention to feathers in the near future. With those, with those waves showing up. All right, Aries. I'm sorry if that was loud. These are kind of new. All right, Spirit. Can I please have a card for Aries towards their person? Aries towards their person. Nine of Cups. Could be a Libra, but you feel like you feel like they're your wish fulfillment. You might have had so many offers, like other offers come in before you met this person. And it was nothing that like spiked your interest. You just had your back to all these other offers. Okay. Spirit, can I have a card for Aries person's energy towards Aries? Thank you, Spirit. Two of Swords. Six of Wands. They're moving out of this energy, but it's like they might be closed off right now. It's like they're trying to, you know, 
are they happy without me? Or are they happy without me? Should I move towards them? Should I move towards them? It's like they're so in their head about it. They just, they all they need to do is make a decision and they will. There's that communication. But right now, it's there's some, they're going back and forth with it. The current situation between Aries and their person. Thank you. Two of coins. Yeah, it's like a balancing act. It's like you're awakened to what this is and what you feel for this person. It's like you're shooting your arrow. But it's like, you know, two, two. It's definitely a decision needs to be made. The wheel's turning with the situation. Divine masculine might make the make make the move. There's so much hurt here. Oh, Aries. All right. What is what is one of the benefits to Aries and their person? Thank you, Spirit. You guys are in total. All right, let me see what the other ones say before I say anything. Because they all turned over, so we're going to take them. Well, first of all, see, this is definitely going to turn around in your favor. These are all major arcana. This is the advice, okay? So one, spirit is assisting in this with all this major arcana for the advice. But you got, both of you have the magic to manifest the life that you want with one another. Your person might have pain from another situation, pain from other things that might be happening in their life that's, you know, ca causing them to be having too many things to juggle and not knowing what decisions to make. But you guys are totally able to, you, you have the magic to make the best life for you guys. You are going to do it. You're going to take that leap of faith. And through it, you're going to find this strength to protect one another. This strength to keep moving towards the relationship that both of you deserve. You already know that this person is your wish fulfillment. It might be that you were married to this person in a separation. But I feel like there's going to be a... A leveling up of your commitment once you work everything out. And like I said, it's divinely connected. You might both be mirroring each other. It's like there's things that are hidden. All right. What is a weakness to this connection? Spirit, what is a weakness to this connection with Aries and their person? Three of Wands. These didn't flip over, but... Yeah, things are going to start working out in your favor. What is a weakness to this connection? For Aries and their person. Thank you, Spirit. Six of Coins. Before, it might... You guys might have been too generous. You might have been too giving to other people. Maybe um, healing family issues. It, it might not have been a balance of energy between the two of you. Maybe you guys were always putting your energy out, lending people money, doing for other people and not being, and not like worrying about yourselves. What is the overall connection? I mean, the overall outcome for Aries and their person. The overall outcome for Aries and their thank you spirit. There is that gonna it's gonna be that communication that comes in. It's gonna be that talk that you have to get clarity on how you both are feeling. 
you both cannot get each other out of your mind. It's going to be that realization that you want to come together and work on this. There's definitely going to be that clarity. It's going to put an end to all of this mental conflict. You guys could be dreaming about each other. This is going to be the outcome, but I need to... Is, it, is Aries with this person currently? Is Aries with this person currently? Is Aries with this person currently? Spirit? I'm going to say no because one, the Five of Swords is at the bottom. But look at this. There was a healing for whatever happened in the past. There was like a, basically a ladder, ladder of conflict, a deception, maybe lies. There was a healing that needed to take place. You guys weren't on the same page. There is like some kind of discussion that needs to come together. To, clear, to just bring clarity to what you truly want. And fortunately, you know that this is your person. You feel like this person's your wish fulfillment. But unfortunately, because it's like your person's kind of struggling with the two of swords. They might have so much going on right now that they may not be open to it. But one, we're gonna get we're gonna get clarity from one to four months. Spirit, how is this gonna progress from now to four months from now? Thank you, Spirit. Four of Wands. You guys are gonna find that stability, that happiness, that support for one another. Love that. For four to eight months for Aries and that person. Great. All right. Look at this. This all popped out. They want to come towards you. There is going to be an interaction, a loving interaction. They realize that they want to work on it with you. Four to eight months from now. And it's like they're going to wait. They already established a relationship with you, a commitment with you. It may be at a separation. And depending on like time, it, it could be recently. But I think this it's been a little bit longer than recently. Could even be a couple years. But it's, they've already did the groundwork for the two of you. They want to work on it and make it grow. And look, you might be dealing with another fire sign, but it's like that leveling up, that pers different perspective on this. And it's hard for 8 to 12 months. 8 to 12 months. For Aries and that person. Thank you. Look at that. Aries, this is an amazing reading. Yes, there are some struggle. And I'm going to clarify it. Why is the two of squirts here for Aries person? Yeah, they've got other struggles. I don't think it's with you. I think they've got other struggles that they're going through and may not have, are able to give 100%. Why is the two of queens here? Guys, pay attention to repeating twos. They, there, there's definitely an awakening on their part of this connection. And why is the Magician, the Fool, and the Shred card here? I have three major arcana here. You are never going to believe what just popped out, guys. 
look at this. This is what you guys are, this is what you, you are going to be that couple that everybody looks at and thinks like, man, they've really been through some struggles, but look at them. You're definitely each other's soulmate. You could be a twin flame connection because you got these two cards here. Clarify and see just swords and the nine of swords, please. Thank you, Spirit. Yeah, you guys have got to talk about the toxic things that put you in this. And I really think it's other situations outside of the two of you. Remember, heart-to-heart -heart conversations is going to lead you to this. It's going to lead you to the Six of Coins energy, the give and take, the equal give and take. And you're going to, this definitely might be a twin flame connection. You're going to get out of that toxic energy. Your, your person is going to move to a more stable grounding and be able to focus on the two of you. Through this turmoil, oh wow, look at this. I was just going to repeat this. Through this turmoil is when this bond grows. Please clarify temperance and the seven of swords. I'm getting emotional for you guys. I feel like Aries readings always gets me emotional. Please clarify. And I don't have, I mean, I have Aries moon. Yeah. You guys have definitely got to go within and heal yourselves. There's definitely hurt. It's like the two of you cannot get over. It might be painful for you to watch your person go through some struggles. But you guys have definitely got to love on yourselves. Self-love during this time. And then... Love for one another. You got to set boundaries for yourself, Aries. I don't know why I feel like I need to say that. But Aries usually, you usually are very strong. I mean, you are the emperor. But I feel like that one person might cause you to stray um, and basically be, be willing to give more to them and what their situation is than worry about yourselves. And you got to make sure that it's a fine line. Messages between Aries and their person. Messages between Aries and their person. Thank you, Spirit. You speak to me through music. Spirit might be telling you to listen to songs that you're drawn to. There could be words that are guiding you. I can't stop thinking about you. Yeah. I left you before you could leave me. I really feel like your person walked away from you because of things that they had going on. I really, really do. And then after they walked away, they're like, you know, what the F? What did I do? No, that is my person. Okay. Any other final messages you know what message I just got like well first of all lightning's at the bottom sudden change shocking news surprise epiphany transformation this card right here stabbed in the back heartbreak pain separation your person might have gone through family issues and their family or somebody very close to them hurt them. The snake, competition, enemy, clever, malicious, look over your shoulder. Yeah, there might have been a friend, a close family member that was very jealous of the connection you guys had. I really am getting that wedding rings, union, wedding, married, soul connection, eternal love. For some of you, you might end up marrying this person. You might have been married and separated, but it's like that. 
It's that, it's that relationship, that unbreakable bond. The relationship is over. No second chances. Grow and transform your life. That might have been what you guys felt when this completely ended the first time. You might have definitely felt that. But look, the lightning was at the bottom. Like I said, it was through the turmoil that you realized how much you cared about each other. And Aries, this is... If this pain does happen during your birthday, remember how it ends. Remember how strong you guys are going to become. All right, guys. Like I said, check out my Etsy channel, um, Lotus444. And if you are new, subscribe, like, and share. That way you'll continue to get notifications of all the readings that I do. But also, I can pick up on your energy and make it more personal for you. Spirit will send me energies through my energy that I'm, you know, meditating on. And it will stand out for you guys. Okay? Love and light. Stay safe.